Good morning, this is Ethan Cole with Alderman's Toyota, where your satisfaction is our top priority. I have a really exciting truck here for us today. It is a 2024 Toyota Tundra. This one is the off-road trim, so the TRD off-road trim. It's finished in a very unique color. We don't see a lot of colors on these trucks all too often. This one's finished in blueprint. You have the uh, blacked out Tundra logo on the sides there, and the SR5 logo on the top over there. But Starting right off, let's take a look at this really neat looking front end. Of course, since it is the TRD off-road trim, you got your TRD branding all over this thing. Uh, right there on the grill, you see a little TRD logo. And then down below here, you see Tundra. Um, right here, this also has the little um, parking sensors. You have LED fog lights, as well as full LED lights on this vehicle. You have a nice chrome surround, a little more chrome accents throughout this entire vehicle. Coming over to the right, you have this really nice TRD looking wheel. You have that black color and then around it, you do have this machine finish. These are wrapped in Michelin LTX trail tires. Really nice set of wheels and tires on this one. You have the Bilstein suspension inside here. So you can see that's marked by having that uh, nicer color in there. Composite fenders, which is gonna be great for if you're going off road, you don't wanna ding up that paint. Right over here, you have black mirrors right here. Um, and then again, blacked out down there on the Tundra logo. This is gonna have a pretty big thing right here, their breakaway too, as well. Um, this is a crew cab right here. So you have the, uh, the bigger cab in the back here. You also do have proximity lock and unlock on this vehicle. So push of a button right there, locks the vehicle. Hand underneath, unlocks it. As long as you have the key on with you. Taking another step back, it's a nice looking truck here I believe this has a slightly bigger bed than normal is normally there's a five and a half foot bed on this one I think this one's six and a half you have the tundra logo on the back here again blacked out and there is a little bit of an inlay on this right there giving it a little bit more definition four by four is also blacked out chrome again and a tow hitch receiver you have your seven pin and your four pin connector right there and soft drop tailgate. Of course, this Tundra is a composite aluminum reinforced bed, so you don't need to go through, get a cover or anything like that. And you have the deck rail system in the back. Um, a lot of tie downs too, really nice to have. And nice sturdy, heavy feeling truck bed. More little safety things right there. That's for when you're backing up. And again, mud guards in the back as well get that suspension there too so let me go through kind of unlock this vehicle first so i only unlocked that um, door right there and you can actually from the key fob itself on drop that rear tailgate but unlocking this this is the sr5 grade uh, right here is the all weather floor mats i'll just slide these over then you have the usb charging cables for all different cables you could possibly need and then a toyota branded first aid kit i never have enough first aid kits uh -huh. What's neat about the Tundra is you have a little bit of storage back here. As you can see, these fold pretty much straight down. And then right here, it comes right up, locks in there, and you have a little bit of a uh, little thing so you can kind of change up what sort of compartment it is. It says Tundra right there again, reminding you that this is, in fact, a Toyota Tundra. Um, dropping this down with a pole right here on this little uh, lanyard thing. Sends it down. And it would have gone down all the way if I didn't have the all weather floor mat box still there. But uh, nice fabric seats, a little bit of a different stitch in the center here with a pattern on each side. Three passengers in the back here. Uh, but anyways, let's hop in the back here uh, but as we get up. Nice soft door cards right there. Uh, a little bit of hard plastic there, but still pretty soft and comfortable. In the back seats now, these seats, even though there's only just a little bit of cupping, on them, they hold you in kind of nicely. It's nice to have. Uh, the inside, since this is the TRD, you get a little bit of a nicer treatment when it comes to the uh, things that are important in here. So you get those pedals, aluminum sport pedals, you got a TRD off-road push to start button, and a TRD off-road uh, gear shift selector. Um, in the back here, you have some more vents on the side there, and then you also do have, right here, you have your uh, charge cable, or a charge port right there, and a USB Type-C charge port. And again, all your charging needs right here. I'll put that 
right there, so it's safe. Big compartment there, which I'll show you in a second. But let's hop on up, take a look at the interior and the couple of things that you have up front. So again, just a fabric trim seat here, decent bolstering. Um, let's hop in. Here I am. Also, I don't know if I mentioned it, but plenty of room back there with this uh, crew, crew Max cab. Push to start. I'll lift this up a little bit. Get a nice little startup animation where it says Tundra. And then you have analog gauge clusters on the side for your, um, oh, let me turn that music off, for your tack and your, also your speedometer. Um, you have automatic climate control, so I'll go through, I'll set it to, uh, let's do 70, and I'll get the entire cabin up to 70. You have a really nice high quality reverse camera with predicted path of travel. As you can see right there, it's giving me a little bit of a uh, idea of where we'd be heading. And I'll turn on the lights on all the way so we can get an idea of what they're gonna look like. Pre-collision detection systems right here as well. You can turn all that stuff off. Um, there's radar cruise control on this vehicle and automatic lighting. And then down here, you can actually adjust the uh, the low beam setting so it doesn't blind other people in case you have something in the trunk, or in the, in the bed, excuse me. Hopping on down. TRD off-road logo in the back. LED bed lighting, LED everywhere, even for the license plate. Got a nice, another angle for you here. And let me just double check, make sure that this is a longer bed. I mean, it looks like it is, but I'm not always perfect with this sort of stuff. So, yep, Crew Max, six and a half foot bed right here. You're gonna get 19 city, 17, uh, or 19 combined, 17 city, 22 highway. And you're gonna get 389 horsepower and 479 pound feet of torque with this V6 with a twin turbo. And you're also gonna have uh, that 10 speed automatic for very smooth shifts. Now let's go up to the front, get a little bit of that halo effect there with the orange LED lights there. And then that one's gonna be your high beams. And then you have your, down there, fog lights, LED fog lights. I really like the way the entire front end of this vehicle looks. I'll take a step back, kind of get another angle of that too. All right, that's gonna do it for me. If you'd like to learn more about the pricing and availability of this vehicle, I'll leave a link down below in the description where you can find out more about that or come see it for yourself here at Alderman's Toyota on Route 7 South here in Rutland, Vermont. I've been Ethan. Thank you so much for watching.